All right, our final play of the week nominee comes to us courtesy of winter set. We saw it earlier. The leaping grab by Charlie McDonald in the second quarter of that game, uh, getting up and getting that ball over the defender. Not an easy catch to make, but he comes down with it. So let's head over now to Bond Ranch. The Blue Jays were hosting Gilbert. Second quarter, Jays up 6 0. Colby Carlson threads the needle to Titus Cram. That is going to be good for a Blue Jay touchdown. He can run wild on defenses and he can make plays like that. What can't he do is the question, really. They go for the two point conversion here. They're going to give it to Caleb Moore. He will waltz into the end zone to make it a 14 0 ball game. But here comes the Tigers. Owen Cotman to Owen Worth. He's wide open, not a Blue Jay. Inside. He manages to stay on his feet though from one Owen to another. That'll get Gilbert on the board. But Ponder ran for our would take over this game after that. They cruise past Gilbert 48 to 7. The Des Moines Christian Lions hosting the ACGC Chargers. ACGC stayed true to a running game that got them in trouble a few minutes into the half. There's a fumble recovered by Max Kirkman, and now Des Moines Christian ends up capitalizing. That's a touchdown, Lions up 7-0. On a night, the Chargers teammates and fans rallied not only to score once, but they went for two, and that two-point conversion was successful. But they got an onside kick later in the game, and that ended up being the difference. The Chargers beat the Lions 32-27. For this week's fan of the game, it was too difficult to just choose one. So let's call it fans of the game. Congrats to the Des Moines East cheerleading captains, Honey Hanawalt and Alexia Sanchez. I love seeing girls come together and just having fun and getting the student section hype. I love seeing everyone come together as a community and just having fun. Our alumni is super strong and they always come to our games and it's just super fun seeing people come back. Um, we participate in all theme days. We actually like, we got our cheer team, like we didn't have a big cheer team, but this year we came back and we just brought the East cheer team back to life again. Yeah, we just wanted to see more girls come out and have fun, so we decided, you know, if no one's going to be out there cheering, then why, sh why should we? Like, we should be out there. Well, it's time for another quick break, but when we come back, find out who had our play of the week, plus we reveal our next game of the week.